Oh, Dr. Love, knocking the shit out of nine dumb scum and uh, chicken head 225. They got the whole damn hunches to know the difference. We know the booty hole, and we know the asshole. <laughs> and you got the booty hole along with the asshole. So we don't like, we like booty. Sometimes you may run up on a big booty, or your booty. And you might want to shake that booty. <laughs> if you shake that booty, you think the mojo is going to stand up. Don't he, Leroy? <laughs> what you mean if he shakes his booty, my mojo is going to stand out of tension? If he shakes his booty, it might stand out of tension, Leroy. But then again, I don't think so, Leroy, because he's a man. Looking for attention. Aren't you looking for attention? How bad is Miss Benitez? How, how is my girl doing? Now, what was her name again? Carmen. How is my girl Carmen doing tonight, this morning? Is she okay? You will never let me talk to Carmen. So I gotta use my figures of imagination up in here. I gotta make a phone call and I got to call my Carmen on the phone. <laughs> Excuse me, everybody. Hey. I got your call. Let me see it. It's a phone ring. You might be sleeping. Please leave a message after the town. If you're looking for common press one, if you're looking for Mr. Benitez, press three. Police force 
made made detectives. You know, you gotta put in motherfucking hard work. Your motherfucking IQ better be as, as, as goddamn high as that motherfucking Richie. Okay, you know where that is. Did you be you ever been in, in, in the Air Force or the Navy? Or anything like that? I, I don't think so. But they did, I don't goddamn think so. You probably got your high school diploma. Your, your junior high school. And high school diploma. You probably got all that there and everything like that. But did you ever take the test for being a police officer? Or a correction officer or anything like that? I don't think so. I don't want to talk to you now. The only thing I fucking want to get a conversation with you, bitch. No, no, no. Get in a conversation with you, man. Make me want to go to fucking sleep. I don't want no conversation with you. Okay? You forget that shit. That would be the last thing for me to hold a goddamn conversation with you. Now, you came around and you heard Richie talk and you don't believe the shit that he say. Everything's a fucking lie. Well, that's for you to believe. That's your belief. You know, you believe anything you want to believe and believe half of what you don't want to believe and everything like that. But if you don't like the goddamn the game that that damn the Richie played, man, this day back your ass on up. It could have been you, but it's not you. It was all about Mr. 127 I was talking to out here tonight. It had nothing to do with you. But we don't therefore know that you ain't wasn't in no military. You wasn't in, in the cadets. You know, anything like that. Please, man. Now, you might have a gun because you're a tough guy. Y'all guys, they used to carry knives before, but now you got a gun. I don't know. There ain't no damn 22. Why would you want to buy a fucking 22? Shit. You got, you got, you got, got an automatic over there. Well, you got it behind the dresser. Underneath, ain't, ain't, ain't no hiding, it ain't, uh, that ain't no hiding place underneath the goddamn mattress. You got to hide it so anybody come over there, the kids come over for visits, stuff like that, that they don't find the goddamn gun. And start playing with it, thinking it's a goddamn toy and somebody gets shot. And you do this just fucking time. Because you got a unlicensed goddamn pistol. Okay? Now, Richie, if you want to go get his license back, you just go take the test. If he ain't still got his gun license. He's got to get his driving license and get his license. So proud. Hey, hey, Richie, proud. Proud of, be proud of yourself, man. Be proud, real proud of yourself. Don't worry about this clown. Don't worry about that clown. Don't worry about that clown. That guy, this guy ain't got nothing for you, Richie. You're a heavy dude. You're, you're a heavy dude, and you don't spend in all this army and everything like that. You don't learn how to fight military and everything like that. Take a motherfucker down and everything like that. You ain't got to worry about that that guy right there. You can take him down, man. He come want to play gangster and, and come to you, step to you. You show him what the hell you made of. If he pull, if he pull on you, pull back on him. Pull on him quick. Do like the goddamn rifle man. Pull. <laughs> Hello, everybody. And the shit I got right here. Come back out right the backyard, yes. Got ready to about to take the shit right now. Can't mess with pistol. Okay, you try to get your buddy to do it, man. That two, 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 five. But he chucked out. That mucked up, chucked out. Come on, what is that, man? I know one thing, Doc been rocking these radios for seven years the same way, day in and day out. If his radio's taking shit, it's because they went to a new technician recently. Step it all over your base. 
study out there. Yeah, but yeah, carry, carrying you on and everything like that. Knowing it ain't gonna go down like that. Messing around with the white boy. You get your ass hurt up. That man dump truck, that man some officer gonna be taking that dump truck to the goddamn town or some goddamn where down by the precinct and cross that bitch. Sit there long enough. And yeah, I have a tow truck come to pick that shit up. I got a couple of guys out here that pick up trucks and cars and everything, too. They got flatbed. I know a couple of guys that would pick it up in a goddamn hurry. Don't say nothing to me, Ted. Please, man. You, you can be like a yeast inspection sometime, man. God damn. You just fucking flare up at any goddamn time, any goddamn moment, man. Man, Leroy, where the fuck is the preparation? Ain't that, Leroy? What's going on now, brother, brother? Man, man, my hemorrhoids are fucking start to flare up because this goddamn dying dummy scum. Oh, God, the, not the hemorrhoids again. Well, something has got that. It has to be those damn hemorrhoids. Just tell me where the preparation ain't you there. I'll go get it myself. And I'm bad for all kinds of If it's not there, then put it in the drawer. It should be there. What the? What? No, I don't need no damn help, Leroy. Putting no preparation on, I need no help. Shit. No two hands is better than one. Don't need your hand on my ass straight. Get on out the way. This young, young buck. Always oh, comes fucking with old G. Now, what the hell can we give you, buddy? Now, we don't need a, we don't need our shoe shine. We don't need the tip shine. But you want to borrow my pool stick? Want to play some pool? Want to? Got a pool stick here. You got the damn chalk. Got the cue ball to go with it. Got the eight ball. <laughs> yeah, I got to talk to these guys, Mr. Richie, Mr. Pistol Grip. Got to let them know what time it is, man. I'm up here messing with old G. Shoot, I still got a got guy man tight. Up tight and out of sight. Kick yourself. You got them play yourself and they got them wreck yourself. Don't hate a player like that, man. Richie hates the motherfucking game. That the self blucker is playing. About it, homie. about it, homie pistol grip. Are you still there? How about it, Detective Taffy? Richie Taffy, Detective Richie Taffy, I think that's what they call you on the force.
And that dumb fucker's a flat lever. You dumb fucker, you. Wait till, wait, wait till the trouble comes my goddamn way and then you leave my black ass. Where are the fucking cops and detectives you are? Supposed to have my goddamn back. Okay. For yourself. I see how you're rolling, buddy. Alright. They come and get that ass. I ain't calling them the fucking cops. I'm not calling the cops. But just let you gonna have to get that ass kicking. And I'll call the cops after you see down on that ground. Then I'll call the goddamn cops. You wanna play like that? Man, I'm sitting right here listening to you beat the shit out of them. You backed them both up. You got homo chicken had to key up five times and cackle ghost talk and say nothing to what you reckon. He's screaming about how your radio is going to take a shit in a dump. I'm like, you've been doing this with your radios for years, man. If your radio, your radio is taking a shit in a dump now, who's going to get the blame and why? When they did all that thing for so many years, that's the way they doing. But nevertheless, Doc, I'm sitting back in the cup, man. I didn't flat leave you. I'm listening to your work. I'm listening to smooth operate, operate. You said I'm going to smoke the bad. You got it right. You know how the girls sing the song about the doctor. You put that cactus and chicken at his home all back there. Is that too fat? You know, I'm trying to be nice to that guy, Richie, that, that 225. I'm trying to be nice. You know, but, but then he, he still want to be on my shit list and everything like that. He want to be tough and everything. Poke his chest out, man. I ain't got time for his shit. But this guy, Cupcake, what do you call the guy, Cupcake, or... What do you, what you call him? You gave him some damn name. I don't know if that's Cupcake. But I don't name it Benito. Benitez. Hey, Richie, you know I look that shit up on, on my phone? I asked him, listen, what is Benitez in Spanish? And he said, it could be pretty, it could be somebody that's cute, uh, somebody that's handsome. Well, she gave me about four damn ways that I, I got in there and put that damn thing. <laughs> but it sounded like some girl shit, woman, for a woman. And I said, no, hold the fuck up. Who in the world, you know how it's your parents and everything like that, you know, they, they get small. You know, sometimes the, the mother uh, leave it with the parents and um, the grandmother say, oh, that's my, that's my favorite grandson. Uh, that's my favorite grand, granddaughter. Well, grandma gave them everything because grandma, um, Mother would work too hard, she worked too hard, so they would grandma, they would stay at grandma. So grandma got her favorite son right there. And she knew that was her favorite son, be her first son. And she said, oh, uh, the other sister, the, the, she said, oh, uh, uh, what would you, what, what would you like to name the great, your grandson? She said, I'll uh, call my, name my grandson Benitez. Benito. Okay, we're doing the name Benito. And something like that. Benitez, Benito, whatever it is, it's pretty. <laughs> That's a damn. Grandma tried to make a goddamn a fag it out. A fag out is a grand her son. Dress them all up cute and everything. Come here, Benita. Let me tie your shit. Come here now, come to Grandma. You gotta, you gotta go to school looking pretty now. I want you to look better than all the kids in the school. Fine clothes, fine shoes and everything, so pop those. And, you know, they get so, so much there, Richie. When you do it like that, man, the kid gets soft. Start to get soft because they get so much and everything. And so much attention from the grandmother. <laughs> I can't do it no more. I gotta go, Richard. I, I can't. I can't. Let me turn my body to pass back. <laughs> so 
what she's saying. The chicken ends up putting you to sleep, too. Richie, Mr. Hunter, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, Richie. You got some old guy named yeah, guys out here that be born. And, and they act just like their sister and everything like that. You see them, Richie, they, when they get to talking, they put their hand on their hip. <laughs> I never had no sisters, so uh, I, you know, I don't know what to imitate or throw there, but uh, you say these cats acting like they sisters out here. Damn it, boy. They get, because cause, 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 cause grandma and them, you know, spoiled them. They get so goddamn fucking spoiled and every goddamn thing. Grandma gives them every fucking thing in the world. Everything. They, they ain't got to go to the store and, and tap their feet and cry and everything like that. They say, Grandma, Grandma, I want that toy right there. Now, they got money, and Grandma buy the toy. Grandma, Grandma, let me, there's a horse, Grandma, let me get on the horse. You know, they in front of the stores and shit like that. Okay, okay. And so grandma might not have to say, Grandma, Grandma, uh, I'll get changed. Give me a dollar, Grandma. I'll go in the store and have some apples. Say, I want to ride the horsey. <laughs> you know the smart kid, Doc, right? You know the smart boy growing up, right? He's screaming, Mommy, 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 I got to make pee-pee. I got to make pee-pee. She says, okay, I'll take you in a second. He says, no, let Grandma, her handshakes. <laughs> you stupid motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh God, Richie! Oh boy, you got that one! <laughs> oh Lord! <laughs> Listen, don't get all choked up over it, huh? Just, you know, try to imagine the scenario. <laughs> What's screaming? I gotta make <laughs> Okay, I'll take you to know that grandma, her handshake. <laughs> Fucking mighty coke. 
Right to myself. I tell you, I mean, no, no, he probably said, God damn, can't fail. That's the same one, that one. And I found, I'm saying to myself, yeah, right. Look at you, you fucking mighty cone. You dress like a fucking woman, bitch. I can't tell left. I gotta laugh with that. These motherfucking cute. But they come out, they come out like that because something, um, something's been wrong. They, they just been some freaky shit going on in the family. You know, maybe the, maybe the grandmother playing with the dingling and the kids dingling and everything like that, which changed the, the, the baby diaper like Benitez got that name shoot and everything like that. So he stayed with grandma. He's still with grandma right now. Grandma took him in. Grandma ain't gonna let his grandson be in the street. Grandma took her in. Grandma been changing that damn diaper. God damn, the damn diggling pop up in and, and, and grandma say, I guess that goes to Eddie. Mira, mira eso. I said, para, holy shit. And the mother's telling him, grandma say, that the dick's standing up. It, that it, it's hard. He said, look at you, kiss that go. She's like, she's giggling like a motherfucker. And now the baby knows, the baby knows real good. Because the baby starts to smiling. Yeah, Grandma. <laughs> so she used to play with the dingling. When the kid get grown, he become a, a sissy. <laughs> like, like this guy, you know, I'm talk. I don't talk to him. But the guy that comes out here every fucking with me. The plain of sample, Richie. Grandma was playing with that dick. <laughs> and he, he's still used to being with Grandma. He with Grandma right now. Grandma ain't going to that damn bathroom because he's a, he a grown man. Grandma going in that damn bathroom and she pushed that damn door open. <laughs> He's going to say, sorry, Grandma. All right, chucha loco.